I've refilmed this video a lot of times. In fact, I tried to film it last week, but I kept exceeding the time limit by far too much. So hopefully this time I'll get it. Um, I sort of wanted to talk about how uh, this whole experience has been very similar to when I lived in Mexico. I lived in freshman year. I lived in Mexico for six months, so I missed half of school, and all of my schooling was online. <laughs> uh, teachers would send me assignments, although it depended on the teacher. Biology, I really didn't do anything. My biology was petting gray, wh gray whales and swimming with whale sharks and setting free sea turtles, and that was epic. Um, but all of my assignments were online, specifically math. I, I'm not a very good math student, and that is something I struggled with a lot online. I got an A at the end because my parents just had to give Mr. Boff and my grades, and that was that, but it took a lot of self-motivation to actually do my homework, especially when my parents were more helping my brothers who were struggling a lot uh, with homework and stuff. Um, but just being, having to do all of my homework online took a lot of self-motivation, which I've already, and that's been useful in this. Um, and and not just that, it, it was because we hadn't lived in Mexico for like 10 years, like I've lived in Leroy, we didn't like walk around. So we were in our house for like the majority of the time, uh, and uh, except for Sundays when we went to church. So it was a lot of staying at home 24-7 with my parents and my entire family, unless we were doing something crazy epic cool, like swimming with whale sharks or gathering data on sea turtles. Um, and it, it was just sort of that. And it's a very similar experience, albeit Mexico didn't have like life-threatening disease. But yeah, and I've also exceeded the time, but this is the best I've done, so.